Today's page one story, the New York Times reports that recent polls and interviews show many Russians are now rallying around Vladimir Putin. Joining me now is Ivan Nechepurenko, a reporter with the Moscow Bureau of the New York Times. He's currently working out of Istanbul. He shares the byline on the story, which is titled, Shaken at First, Many Russians Now Rally Behind Putin's Invasion. Ivan, you and your colleagues have written this. You say, five weeks into President Vladimir Putin's invasion of Ukraine, there are signs that the Russian public's initial shock has given way to a mix of support for their troops and anger at the West. So what changed? What has happened? Well, when the invasion just started, people basically had to make a choice either to support it or not support it. There was a, a battle for people's minds in Russia, and the state-run propaganda was working full force to make sure as many people get onto the President Putin's side as possible. And it seems that they have succeeded so far and many people who are, who opposed the war they either left or they faced uh you know uh criminal prosecution really because people who went out in the first days of the invasion they were brutally arrested and many of them were sentenced to administrative arrests so the government has clearly shown the limits of uh, of its power and went beyond of what it did before to make sure as many people support the war, or at least say they support the war. We need to make this caveat that uh, when a pollster calls you in Russia and asks you whether you support Vladimir Putin, whether you support the war, and if uh, you say no, uh, and that answer might, uh, you know, uh, bring uh, a criminal uh, prosecution against you, then uh, I think most people would say that they do support the war, even if they think otherwise.